there. Finding your ideal client, unfortunately, is not going to help you to grow your business. My name is Tineke Rense from Powerful Business Academy and I help business women to scale and grow their business. Now, there is, of course, a truth in it. You will be able, when you have your ideal clients, to scale your business. But knowing who your ideal client is, is not enough. And I know there are many training companies and coaches out there who say, whenever I found my ideal client, my business started to skyrocket. Well, that's not true. Because you need to know many other things and you need to have many other skills before you will be able to skill your business and get more clients. So what's going on? Knowing who your ideal client is, is one thing. But then you need to know where they are and how you can find them. You also need to know how you need to position yourself towards your ideal client. So what is it that they need that you have to offer and how do you position that towards your ideal client? You also need to know how to craft your offer. So what is it that you exactly need to offer? And then, of course, you need to know how to sell it. And believe me, it is not true that when you know who your ideal client is, magically your clients enter into your business. It's hard work. You need to reach out to your clients, your potential clients. It's not very often that they reach out to you. Yes, it happens. Word of mouth maybe referral marketing. But when that's not the case, you need to be in the driver's seat and you need to take action and you need to talk to your ideal clients. And just talking to them is not going to serve anything if you're not willing to sell to them. So having a conversation with your ideal client is beautiful, but not when you don't want to step over and across the boundary that you need to sell to them. They are not going to ask you, hey, what can you offer me? Sometimes they do, yes, occasionally, and then you might think, oh, Tineke, it's not true what you say. Well, I know it is true. If you really want to grow your business, you need to market and sell to your ideal clients. So only knowing who they are is not going to help you. And the willingness to sell and better to serve, because that's what selling is all about. It's serving your ideal client in helping them to make a decision to start working with you. So selling is all about serving and making your ideal client see that they have a problem and you have the solution. And the selling is that you make them want that solution and make them open their eyes that you are the person who can offer it to them. So I hope you understand there's a lot more to it. And everybody who speaks to you and says, you need to know who your ideal client is. Or when women come to me, eh, I have a Facebook group and we will promote the link at the end of the video so you can join. Whenever they enter my Facebook group, I ask them some questions. And then they say, one, very often I hear, I hear not knowing who my ideal client is. And I think, okay, that's just where it starts. When you know who your ideal client is, you still need to know a lot of other stuff. So I hope I've explained this to you in this video and that you understand there's a lot more to it. If you want to find out who your ideal client is and how you can market to them, send them an offer, convert and sell, or even better, we do most of the part for you. We position you in front of your ideal client. We schedule the call with you. Well, you have to do the conversation and have to close the deal, of course. 
But if that's what you like, uh, send me an, uh, a message or down the video below there's a link and you can just schedule a 15 minute call. It's very quick. It's just checking out if we can serve you and help you to double your business in a year and to make sure that we can find the right clients for you because we can't do that for every business. And besides that, I will help you with the sales process. I will help you with the offer. I will help you with the calculation and everything and the positioning. So there's a lot we can do for you. Bye bye for now. And uh, I hope you tune in again next week where I will show you again one thing that you need to know about scaling and growing your business if you're a female entrepreneur. Bye.